guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Chloe if you're new here. I do videos on fitness, nutrition, lifestyle, wellness, everything. Um, and in today's video, I'm so excited. We're doing a favorites video. I would say like a fall favorites, but it's not really fall themed. It's just like it's fall and these are the things that I'm loving. I love doing these videos because I seriously feel like I fixate over things every few months that I just like wear every single day, I drink every single day, eat whatever, um, use, and I just have so many new goodies and I feel like I haven't done one of these since like the beginning of summer, so I'm so excited to share with you guys everything because there's things from like houseware to cookware to clothes, shoes, accessories, um, snacks of course. Um, so yeah, let's just get right into the video. We're gonna start with like the food because it's literally sitting out and I want to kind of get it put away because it's some dairy products, you know. First thing I want to show you guys, you're gonna think I'm crazy and you're gonna think I'm weird, but I promise you it's so good and it's packed with protein. It's this good culture cottage cheese, but the like individual packaging, individual serving ones are like fruit flavored and this one's strawberry, they have like a pineapple one, maybe a blueberry one, maybe I'm wrong on that, but I've had this one and it's so yummy, you guys. It's like sweet, oh, it's like a mango one, I think. May no, maybe that's just whatever there's a few fruit flavored ones and i've had them and they're so delicious because they're kind of sweet they're kind of salty they're packed with protein there's 15 grams in this i love packing these in my lunches to take to campus because like i said it's 15 grams of protein it's so simple and it's something different so i like kind of get burnt out on greek yogurt but with that being said i have found two new greek yogurts that i love and i love to pack for my lunches on campus i literally just had a piece of popcorn stuck in my tooth so if you saw that it's really embarrassing but i'm not refilming it so <laughs> God, I'm like so mad. Anyway, <laughs> back to my my Greek yogurt talk. Um, the Chobani Zero Sugar Single Serving Greek Yogurts are delicious and literally 11 grams of protein, 60 calories. They taste like dessert. They're just so freaking good. They're high protein. Again, I love bringing these to class, eating them in the car. They're just convenient and delicious. And then with the fall spin, um, the Dan and Light and Fit, they have a pumpkin spice one, and it's 12 grams of protein, 80 calories, 8 grams of carbs, zero fat if you're into macros or any of that. But they're so good, you guys. Like It tastes like fall. I love pumpkin spice. I love fall flavors and seasonal flavors and all of that, and so I love these. I do like splurge and venture out because I try to stick to like better ingredient Greek yogurts like the Siggies, but the seasonal flavors just too good to pass up they're just too good and then the last dairy product um this has been pretty much my like nightly dessert every single night i don't know i kind of go through phases and i definitely think this is going to be a phase thing but i'm really into it right now like it's almost embarrassing if you saw my freezer how many of these like enlightened ice creams i have i did a video with them and they sent me a bunch and i literally like fell in love with them they're so delish they're just like the perfect little like sweet tooth when you have like a sweet tooth craving at night like i just have a pint of it or half a pint like whatever and it's just so good and it's so like satisfying um and i just i'm loving it like i don't i don't know i like making my own protein ice cream sometimes but some of the flavors y'all like this one though it's brownie and cookie dough like i eat like the half baked like when i would eat like ben and jerry's like that was my go-to flavor so this is like nostalgic this is my favorite flavor oh so good but literally all the halo top and light flavors are just stockpiled and nyx nyx is really good too but i didn't have any i ate it all <laughs> but um yeah i'm just really into like ice cream right now for some reason which isn't fall at all but i'm loving it oh my god and this is my absolute favorite thing ever taylor i'm so glad i made it for the <laughs> taylor's back in iowa you already saw her in the last vlog so it's not a surprise but <laughs> um, to finish off my food okay you guys literally this nuts and more, when I tell you this stuff is so good. So I get this on campus protein and it's like a pro a high protein like nut butter. Um, Taylor can't eat this unfortunately, or I would literally have her try this and show you guys what she can't eat. <laughs> she can't eat nuts. And it's so freaking good. It's this one's a white chocolate pretzel, but I've had so many <laughs> you literally I didn't even know you were there. Because I was looking at this and I like, felt your like presence. <laughs> oh my god. Um, but this is like it's called a protein superfood. But it's so good like it's so sweet it goes so good on like toast or with apples or in my oats literally on my ice cream at night usually it's just delish so you guys need to try this i'm gonna link it below all the flavors are good though guys this one's really really good chloe's favorite thing is to eat stuff with peanuts or peanut butter and then be like oh this I is so you... good i really <laughs> wish you could try it 
Like, shut literally up. everything. <laughs> like, literally, like, you guys know, like, peanut butter is, like, one of my favorite foods. Like, I made protein balls the other night. I made my granola the other night. She couldn't have any of it. And I'm like, I wish you could eat all of it. But then she this. just has to tell me how good it is. It so is. I'm and it's so it. good. <laughs> but I put there. her on the, oh, the what's it called? Oh, ha, oh, the granola oh, yeah. butter. Yeah. It's, like, yeah. almond butter, but it's made out of oats. That is good. And she can eat it. But, anyway, y'all, if you don't have a nut allergy, like, Taylor, try this out. They have almond butter and peanut butter ones. This one's peanut butter. It's so yum. And then, last snack. I, I got Taylor put on this. The Himalayan Sweetness Lesser Evil Popcorn. You guys know how I am about Lesser Evil products in general. But this, recently, oh my god, just so stinking good. I'm not even going to start snacking on it right now, so we won't be able to stop. But it's just, it's delicious. The ingredients are amazing. It's like kettle corn. This one is. All of their products are good. All of their popcorns are good. But if you like kettle corn, try this out. You will not regret it. They sell it at Target, Walmart, I think. Um, all like health food stores usually carry lesser evil. And now we're going to get into like supplements and beverages. This La Colombe cold brew is to die for. This is my favorite thing ever. I can only find it at Target. But I like, I have my espresso machine and I've just been on a cold brew kick. And like it's been getting a little colder out, so I haven't been drinking it as much. But this is probably my like fifth jug of this. I just bought this on Saturday. It's empty. It's Monday. So um, yeah, I'm obsessed with it. It's like so strong, like caffeinated. Like I'm like wired after a drink, just a little bit of it. And it tastes delicious. I'm I'm obsessed. You guys need to try this. And then supplement wise, okay, you guys, I literally not even affiliated with Beam, but I love their products. I really, really do. So their chocolate greens are so good. Have you tried their chocolate greens, Taylor? No, because you make it with almond oh, milk. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it's really good if you mix this with almond milk because it's literally chocolate milk. Like, you would not know a difference. Yeah, Taylor can't drink almond milk because she's allergic to nuts. But um, it would be, honestly, it's not even bad with water. I should have you try with water and see what you think. Yeah, but sure. it's so good. It tastes like a dessert. Sometimes I put, um, like, the little Alani protein, Alani new protein shakes in with it, and then I make it into, like, a protein shake green. So I'm, like, killing two birds with one stone, you know, protein greens little dessert and it's like super sweet and it's like it literally tastes like dessert so these are really really good their fruit ones are good too but i'm like a diehard chocolate fan so that and their vegan pro whoa their vegan protein powders they sent me their cinnamon crunch one before this literally plow through the top i eat it every single day um i put it in my cream of rice every single day it's my breakfast it's like i have like a specific recipe this is my other favorite this combination literally i i ate it for dinner last night because i didn't have it for breakfast because i ran out and I had to go buy more. And I always now have two boxes. Um, I buy two at a time, so I never run out of it. But the texture of cream of rice is, like, literally just so much better than oats. My friend Sydney um, put me on, like, doing half oats, half cream of rice. That's really good, too. If you're, like, s just want to switch it up, change it up, I do that every now and then. But literally eat cream of rice. It's The texture is, like, so filling. It's, like, dense. It's, like, I just said it's, like, it's, like, it's, like, a million times. But it's delicious. <laughs> Like Especially so with <laughs> it's like so good. <laughs> um, beams vegan protein. It's my favorite. I really do. Like I eat this every single day for breakfast. And that is all the food. That is all the supplements. Um, and now we're gonna get into uh, everything else. Next thing, if you've watched, like I said, any of my YouTube videos, I've talked about this a lot. But if you haven't watched any, y'all need to get yourself a hatch alarm. I love this thing so much because you literally download an app and it like syncs it to it, and you can set like schedules so every single monday through friday i have to go off at 6 a.m i have like the specific like sound you can choose different ones like mine literally sounds like spa music or like when you get a massage like that type of music but it's really i have it really loud so i wake up but then it flashes and it's i have it set for 45 minutes before so it starts at 5 15 and it starts like glowing but then right as like you're supposed to get up at six it's like a full glow so my room's like bright it like wakes me up because light is really important when you're trying to wake up if you struggle getting up in the morning turn on all of your lights like when i get up at six another reason i like this is because it's glowing i literally have to get out of bed and like hold the button down so the like the music stops because it's it's loud and obnoxious well not really but i don't want to hear it at 6 a.m so i have to get out of bed turn it off and then i turn my lights on turn in my apartment and, like wakes me up but i love this because two also at night i have like a night one set and i set it for 45 minutes before i go to bed because i like to lay in bed and it glows. I have like a certain color. I think at night it's like a blue purple. No, that's in the morning. It wakes me up. It's like blue purple. And at night it's like it, it's like orangey red. And it like starts at like full glow, and then it slowly dims. And then once it turns off, the music turns off. It's like rainfall. And then I go to bed. And it's so cool. But you can like change the sounds, the lights, the colors. 
everything um, through the app on your phone, but I don't even have to like think about setting an alarm because it goes off every single day at 6 a.m. It's amazing. I love it. It's seriously life changing because too, like an alarm is like startles you in the morning and like spikes your cortisol and all that. And I hate like nobody likes their alarm. Like it's so obnoxious. But this, like I truly like don't mind getting up. It's like so like kind of peaceful. So if you, it's it's kind of expensive. It's on Amazon, but I seriously, it's worth it. Like waking up in the morning and not like hating your life instantly is like amazing. <laughs> so it's worth it. Um, okay, this is another household item. My always pan. Okay, Campus Protein. Oh, I'm like shaking it. Campus Protein bought me this for my birthday. And I didn't even realize what it was until I got it. And I'm like, why did I never know what this was? It's amazing. It's from the company um, Power Place. But it's seriously, it's like a um, non-stick pan. But it comes with like this dish. So you can like steam veggies. It's so cute. Like they have a bunch of different colors. So it like, matches like an aesthetic. But I literally just have it sitting on my stove because it's like kind of aesthetic. You know, like it looks cute. And um, I cook everything with it. It's amazing and I'm obsessed. Like I want to get another one. I want to get like their pot. You can get like accessories to like do different like cooking things on it. Um, but I just didn't even know they were a thing. They're freaking amazing. And you really, truly, if you want, I feel like it'd be a really good gift to get somebody like for Christmas or the birthday like your mom. Like I'm going to get my mom. She's not going to watch this. I'm going to get her one for Christmas or her birthday because her birthday is in November. So maybe I'll do that because I don't know what else to get her. But it's a, it makes a really good gift because I feel like it's something you use every single day in the kitchen and I love cooking. So yeah. Shout out Campus Protein because they know me so well and I was just a gift I would have never bought myself until I realized I needed it. And so I'm telling you, you need it. It's life changing. It's just a pan, but it's life changing. Okay. So this thing isn't really necessarily like the product itself, but it's like the act of it and it's journaling. Like I'm obsessed with journaling, you guys. Like I'm not telling you what I journal about. You see that? I hope you can't read the words. But like, I literally journal every single day in the morning when I get up at sunrise, boom. And I write down my thoughts, my feelings, I manifest, I write down goals, literally anything that's on my mind. And it's like the best way to start your day because I feel like it's like motivating, it's reflective, you can like reflect on your day before, set like your intentions for the day coming. It's, I love it. Like I never, and I'm, I'm not a writer, like I hate like thinking deeply and like thinking into my thoughts, but I feel like since I've been doing that, one, it's really, really, really cool to look back on. Like, sometimes I read my old, like, journal entries. And, like, I was kind of going through it a little bit this summer. Like, feeling just, like, weird and out of it not myself. And, like, I'm reading now and I'm, like, back in action, baby. I'm, like, better than ever. And it's really, really cool just to, like, see yourself, like, transform mentally and physically. And, like, see your goals kind of, like, actually, like, coming to, like... Like, you're, like, achieving your goals. You know what I'm saying? Like, the things I was writing down and manifesting and hoping I would, like, accomplish back in July. Like, or, like, I've done. Like, I've accomplished them. So it's really cool in that sense and two it's really just like therapeutic and it makes you like sit down and think and i don't know like i don't really like to talk about my feelings but like i can like write them out and talk to myself about them if that makes sense i don't know it's just really really something i never thought i would enjoy it but i it's like my favorite part of my morning i get up and i i get up at six i walk downstairs <laughs> grab my bag like i have it ready to go everything in my little lulu bag and i walk upstairs on my rooftop and i sit and watch the sunrise and i journal Sometimes I read, sometimes I scroll on TikTok and just sit there and like enjoy the sunrise. But journaling at sunrise is just my freaking favorite part of my entire day. And it makes it so much easier to get out of bed knowing like I can go watch the sunrise and write down my thoughts. And it's just great. Now this thing, if you get anything from this entire YouTube video, it is going to be this thing. Okay, guys, this Eco Tools hair scrubber thing. I don't know. I think it was like five or ten. I don't even think it was $10. I literally think it was $5 at Target. But like you scrub your shampoo and... It literally feels kind of good. I'm not gonna lie. It feels good. But I wash my hair with it. Like I get like my hands all soapy, walk, like run the soap through my hair, and then I scrub the crap out of my head with this. And it, my hair has never felt cleaner and more like you know the feeling of your hair after you get it done and they wash it and you're like, how do they get it so like clean? And I don't know. I just never felt like my hair was as clean as when they do it until I got this thing. And I am not even kidding you. I'm obsessed with this. Like it gets every little bit of your hair just feeling good and clean and fresh and. It makes me like, enjoy washing my hair. Is that weird? But like I love just like, it's just such a small weird thing I never thought I would like. And it's life changing for my hair because I try, I'm trying to train my hair too. Like I wash it like once a week. So it's really time to wash it by the time I wash it. And this thing just makes it squeaky clean every freaking time. And I just, I really want you guys to get it. Okay, so please go get one. Next thing is this little purse. This was like, it's funny because it's literally just a purse from Urban Outfitters. 
Um, but I needed one when I went to Chicago with my friends because I didn't really have like a little mini purse just to bring. And we were shopping around and I saw it and I just grabbed it. But I love it. Like this thing goes everywhere with me like when I leave for like an not an event. Like well, for instance, we went tailgating this weekend. I brought it. Um, when else did I, when I was in Chicago, I had it. Like, anytime I'm, like, running an actual, like, like, doing something, you know? I, I've never been a purse girl, but this is just, like, the perfect combination of, like, I don't want a big honking purse, but I don't want, like, a little satchel. And this is just perfect. And it's, I thought it's cute, and it's, like, simple. It matches everything. It's inexpensive. I don't love that it doesn't zip, though. I wish it did zip. That's, like, my going out purse. Yeah, like, when I go out. All right, next thing. This Bays, is it Bays or B? I think it's Bays. This is my luggage brand, so I didn't want to lug my whole entire suitcase down here, but it's this exact same brand in black. I'll, maybe I'll throw a video picture up here or I'll just link it below, but also I love this um, little like toiletry cosmetic bag for traveling um, because I have been traveling a bit more lately, so I'm really starting to appreciate good luggage and like stuff like that like it really makes a difference when you're traveling i'm not gonna lie and this one's really cute and it's like the towel material um but i throw all my like toiletries in here and i just love it and everything by this brand is amazing my mom even bought herself a set of suit like because i got my luggage for christmas last year and then my mom just got her own set of luggage because she loved mine so much but my suitcase has like the handle literally it looks like flash red if it's over 50 pounds which is so handy because i never know what my suitcase like if it's overweight and that's like a stress you know so it just like has a lot of cool little things. It has like a lock on it, but I just really like this too. My mom ordered me this when she got her luggage. And like I it's again like one of those things I never thought I would need or want, but it's just like so handy and I'm obsessed with it and it's really cute. So I wanted to show you all that. I'm ready to get into clothes and shoes. Because that's everything else. Start off with the shoes because I have one pair. My Yeezy slides. I got these for my birthday and I I wear these to the gym. These are, my, these are literally my gym shoes because I work out barefoot now. And they're easy because I can just slide them on when I'm, oh, when I'm walking through the gym and then slide them off when I'm exercising and slide them back on and slide them back off. Like they're just so convenient. They're very neutral looking. Could you probably get the cheaper version on Amazon and not spend? Kind of stupid expensive. Mine but is, Oh my God, my guitar is here. I was going to say, mine gave me blisters. So me yeah, one wear <laughs> socks. Wear socks if you wear them because I did get blisters too when I first wore these barefoot. And, um... One time, I, yeah, so I don't really wear them barefoot anymore unless I'm just, like, running somewhere quick. But I usually always have socks on because I have, like, a weird thing with feet, and I just, like, hate feet, and I don't like seeing them. these in your favorite video? I was going to, but no, should I put them in there? They're so good. Okay, bring them in, bring them in. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're adding a favorite. I literally got it out because I was going to put it in, but then I was like, I don't know. But Can I do know them. I, I know, I did open them upside down, so I can't really show you. Pumpkin Spice Cheerios. This is my favorite. Literally, the box is like, that's mm. so good. Yeah, I know. Okay, so if Taylor likes them, there are Taylor and Chloe approved, so it's not even just my favorites. This is a Chloe Taylor favorite video. But um, these, uh, this is like my pre-workout meal. I bounce between this and my protein French toast. But yesterday I had this with a protein shake as my milk, and it was so delish. But it's this, tis the season, and pumpkin spice is like the best flavor. So, yeah, I've here you go. Seen that you can continue to munch. Thanks. <laughs> more food for Chloe than me. Literally, Taylor just <laughs> moved in and ate all my food. Good thing I bought you a Trader Joe's gift card for your birthday. Yeah, no kidding. You're just really. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, now you're like, yeah, you're even now. You're good. Um, but yeah, I just love these shoes. I wear them all the time. They're so easy. They're cute with like sweats and they're comfy and I just love them. But do you probably need the easy ones? No. But I did get these for my birthday, and I do love them. So if you want to splurge, get these ones, because they're cute and they're fun, and I love them. But just a, honestly, a pair of slides would work, too. Okay, now we're going to get into clothes. Oh, I'm wearing. I'll show you guys the one I'm wearing after then, because I don't want to change. Oh, I still have another thing. Sorry, guys. Okay, my perfume. I almost forgot. Okay, so Dossier. I will link it below. I actually have a discount code with them, because I'm running like a... I worked with them or whatever, but essentially what Dossier is, is like it's a... They take like luxury fragrances, fragrances, wow, and then they like pretty much recreate them. They smell the exact same. I have one like the blo Black Opium by YSL. I have the actual YSL one and then I got their like dupe version. It smells the exact same. But the Ambery Cherry scent is my favorite perfume. I wear it every single day. Like I'm really going through it and I got this like not that like maybe a month ago. I, I put it on every single day. It's notes of cherry almond and cinnamon middle notes of clove cloves rose jasmine plum and then the base notes are peru 
balm, tonka bean, and vanilla. I don't know. It's like, it literally smells like cherry and vanilla. That's what I would say. And it's, oh, it's so good. If you like sweet smells, if you like the smell of cherry. Like, my mom had this, like, cherry soap growing up. And it kind of reminds me of that, but better. And they're literally $30, $40 instead of, like, $150, $200. So, and my discount code will save you even more money. So, check out Dossier's perfumes because they are literally the exact dupes of expensive perfumes. It's insane. Okay, now back to clothing. Follow me on Instagram. You guys know I wear these shorts probably every other day. The Define... Um, defines dynamic shorts. They're like four and a half inch, but the butt cinch literally works wonders. It's quite literally insane. Like, and they're so comfy. They're they kind of run small. I would say though. When you say Taylor, they kind of run small. What are they? My shorts. Oh yeah. Do you think a little small? Yeah. Like they do kind of roll up a little bit. But like, so like when I wear them, they're literally because I got I got some quads, so they do roll up like right under my butt. But so size up maybe if you get a pair but i love them so much and the colors are so cute like they have orange green blue purple black tan like a burgundy color a gray i have every single color but i love the purple ones these are probably my favorite color right now but they do have a new pink limited edition one but i i, I don't have them which is sad because i feel like those would be really cute but blue is my favorite color if you blue is your favorite. favorite okay so taylor likes the blue i like the purple <laughs> stay tuned to seeing us wearing these probably a lot yeah because uh, Taylor eats my food and wears my clothes. <laughs> guys, I'm it's okay, guys. Chloe. I'm very share. I I like I like sharing my stuff with Taylor. I'm making it seem like she's crazy. I love when she wears my stuff. I just, <laughs> you love it. Yeah. <laughs> live I live for it. Seeing Taylor in my dynamic defined shorts. I, I it's kind of funny when me and Taylor the other day we went to the gym and literally we were wearing we were both wearing this this hoodie but in different colors and they were both wearing those shorts. In different colors but this combo look how freaking cute one sec look how cute like together are you kidding yeah adorable but getting into my next piece is raw gear their war gear collection i want to put literally every single piece in it um but i can't obviously so i'm gonna show you my number one piece and that is this crotch hoodie i do tuck it though under my sports box it's kind of an awkward length this is a size medium um but i love it like i literally hit legs in this outfit but different colors yesterday and it was just perfect it's so cute like the pink it's it's adorable and that is going to kind of lead into the sweatpants that i'm wearing they're literally like the sweatpants version of those those uh that sweatshirt like it's a matching set but they have them in this color like they have a sweatshirt no maybe there's not a gray sweatshirt actually i'm wrong but they do have that pink shade of that sweatshirt in these sweatpants i'll show you a better clip in a second when i like get up but the sweatpants this is a terrible angle but they're raw here. They're so comfy. Um, I think I have I have all the colors. I think there's four. I've worn them every single day since I got them last Monday. Actually, I got my package a week ago. And I've worn them every single day. I sleep in them. I work out in them. I chill in them. I'm wearing them right now. Like, they're the comfiest pants ever. Ever, ever, ever. But I would size down if you get them because they're quite large. Because they're men's. So keep that in mind, ladies. But if you're a guy, just... Just get your true, true to size, probably. Um, we'll go into my other pair of sweatpants, and it's actually the matching set of my jacket. And it's the Skims, like, cotton collection. I don't know if this is sold out or not. I haven't honestly even looked. But I ordered it in, like, 15 minutes when it dropped. And I wanted the hoodie, and they were sold out. But I got the zip up, and honestly, I love it even more. It's I just love this, like, shade of gray. It's my favorite. It's, like, a heathery light gray. But they're just, like, drawstring joggers. Nothing too like crazy or special but they're so comfy and they're so cute and literally anything by skims i'm pretty much a sucker for but i love this like it's just so cute i don't know i wear this kind of stuff all the time so it's to me like amazing maybe not to you but we love a good pair of sweats around here so and then my last piece of clothing at this in chicago at the aloe store that was a dangerous place for me to go um but i love it the little aloe bra. I have it in a purple color too. That's honestly really similar to this shade of purple. Um, but it's just the most like simple. I feel like this is like kind of one of their like basic uh, standard sports bras. I don't know. But I love it. It's just like the perfect amount of support. I love this like style of bra. Like an open back, a little scoop. Um, not too high support, but not. I don't like when there's a lot going on and it's like constrictive. But I don't like when you feel like everything's, you know. When you're running and stuff so i just love this bra and i love the colors i think they're really really cute that's the end of my video we really flew through that maybe it's really a lot longer than i think but those are all the things i'm loving right now like i said i'll link every single item that i can find below i feel like i'll be able to find everything um 
But yeah, if you have any questions on like sizing or color, shades, whatever, um, just comment them below or shoot me a DM. Probably comment below though. I'm better about getting back to comments or quicker. So do that. Um, and if you made it to this video, end of this video, thank you for sticking around. I love you so much and I'll see you in the next video.